Ugh. This is why I don't do puns. They're pretty bad. I probably was going to go for a CSI, yeah, for a second there, but my throat is way too raspy right now from two and a half hours of recording. Yes, Goku. I can't. Okay, I got time for one more. <laughs> Enrage, quote unquote, Super Saiyan. Okay. Terror, evil invaders. Like, we haven't had this happen before. A little thing called the Saiyan Saga. No? Okay. An evil Namek bent on conquering the universe. Lord Slug has come to Earth. That's a weird saying, Having bent. regained his youth through the power of the Dragon Balls, he has unleashed his forces upon the planet. The Sea Fighters sprang into action to combat this new threat. However, Damn, he's bulky. One by one, these brave heroes have succumbed to Lord Slug's overwhelming power. But just as all oh, yeah, and now he's gonna do that, Goku's huh? rage has awakened the Super Saiyan within. Well, kinda. He doesn't have nearly the energy output right now to make it in the Super Saiyan. And that form is never playable in the game. It's a false Super Saiyan. He does in the game, in the movie, where he's like in KO Ken, but it's got, got the Super Saiyan Ord. That's so cool. But it's never a thing. That needs to be a thing. At least a Blast 1 in one of the games. Like, fucking Raging Blast. That makes it so cool. I think it would just be a rush move. March, rush move, I suppose. You. What useful advice do you have for me today, motherfucker? Oh, man. No, my son's gonna take your Dar's virginity. Alright, what we got? Glaciers, please have something interesting. I'd like to point out that when you get around to being the Broly Saga, there's always a Broly up here to fight. It's so ridiculous, but he's always level 77, so it's not much of a challenge. You might be better than what I have as alternatives. Like Gohan. No, thank you. Just, mm, yeah, it's my build one times where recruiting a character actually is beneficial instead of just having to default once. How about that? By the way, the entire Earth is coming to, coming to smog right now because Lord Slug has a machine that can do that for some reason or another. The invasion has begun, Lord Slug. And the one man invasion. On conquering the universe has brought his minions to Earth. That we'll never see on screen. The ancient Lord Slug has relied on medical technology to extend his unnaturally long life. We never covered that in the movie. However, having learned of the Earth's Dragon Balls, he now intends to call upon the dragon to restore his youth. And kind of try that on Namek. Yeah, I have been reborn. Feel the power of youth eternal. Hmm. Since a great danger, Goku raced to the sea to face it head on. Hi. I'll give you one chance to leave this planet in peace. Goku, when does that ever work on the villains? <laughs> this will be a good opportunity to test my newly restored powers. Is this the end of the Earth? Or can Goku turn the tide of the slug invasion? Slug invasion. Oh, man. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'd much rather have Tien as backup, although I'm not going to need backup in this because I need some Goku. But you know what I mean? Let's rock and roll. I think I'd just bring one character into into it so he can get double experience. But then that make Goku a farming machine. Ready? Oh, there you are. Let's see what we can do. He just got a lot of health. Plus, truth be told, Slug is kind of a terrible character. And I mean I mean playable wise. And character wise, he's kinda of bad too. What do we got? Yeah. Yeah. This is the closest I'm gonna be able to do for the fall Super Saiyan thing. Oh, that was a throw? Oh, that was gonna be a charge move of some kind. No, no. Damn. That's a very step to throw. If only Goku said you fool during that move, it'd make it perfect. No way, homie. So much blocking. Damn. This is what I was talking about earlier. It seems like some weird thing about the game where they can they won't block like the first one or two hits, but then they'll just randomly block the rest of this thing. It's so strange. I don't know what causes that. 
I don't know what to do. But I do know how to do this. No, not think about it. I could probably follow up with a new move of some kind. Alright. Also, there's one other cool thing about using moves in this game. Whenever you use a rush move and it doesn't hit, you don't lose any energy for it. Like in BG3, you lose like half of it because, well, yeah, you took the risk. But you won't lose anything if you just run out willy nilly. So you saw I just threw up my ultimate blast there and it was a rush, but I didn't lose the max power move when I used it. So there's really no risk to just throwing out rushes. One of them will hit, and one of them will do a lot of damage. Which makes them really overpowered in this game, by the way. Considering you can get free combos strength, afterwards. Goku is still no match for the tireless Lord Slug. Tireless. Has all <laughs> hope been lost? Nope, it's time to pull the concept completely out of our ass. I actually don't know when this movie was released in correlation with... Uh, uh, Goku actually going Super Saiyan on Planet Namek. If, I'm, if I were to guess, I'd guess maybe like during the middle of the Frieza fight, like before he went Super Saiyan, like maybe around like Goku's Frieza going like 50% power. I don't know about that. That's just a guess. <laughs> Is that all you've got? Dick. And here I was hoping a Saiyan would wait for a good challenge. He's strong. This is the same exact fight, again. Why? Why is this a thing? Ugh. Hmm. You guys hear that? That's a, that sound off in distance? Hmm. It sounds like the eerie pitter patter of filler, and padding, ways of artificially extending a game to, game's time. Am I level going crazy? I think I hear that. He just tried taunting me in the middle while I was rushing him down. Sure, you've got balls. By the way, when you have this costume on and you go Super Saiyan, boom, old school hair. Really cool stuff. All the. It was kind of taken out in BG3 where if you play Goku mid, you'll always have that this hair on him. Even the Yardra outfit. Yardra outfit is sexy. Bam, bam, bam. Where's he going? Ugh, man. Super Saiyan Goku is so good. Just because he's got a beam move that's super fast on the charge. And he got a rush move that easy follow ups and there's only three energy bars. <laughs> he was just doing a little couple of, couple of somersaults there. Hold on, guys. I got a stretch before I do anything else. Mutation and giant. What? Mutation and giant form. By the way, those, uh, what I'm unlocking right now, those purple earrings, they're the Batara earrings, by the way. You combine those and unlock characters you're fighting. So I'm pretty sure that would have gotten me Lord Slug when I combined those together. Yeah. So you've got a second win, eh? Then perhaps it's time to show you my true power! Completely glancing over how Goku just kind of went Super Saiyan. You don't mean. Well, pseudo Super Saiyan. I don't know how to describe it. It's like, uh, the way I always thought about it is kind of the opposite of what the Dragon Ball Wiki is saying. I think it's kind of the result of, uh, my assumption was that he all, he never had enough power behind what he was doing in order to go Super Saiyan. Like, I've always thought you had to be like at least a certain baseline of power to do it. Lord Slug has transformed himself, increasing his size and power tenfold. But no, apparently you can go Super Saiyan in any power level. Which I guess explains why Barak's able to do it, and he couldn't go go toe to toe with that against Riza. But then I guess not counting the power boost after he got nearly killed. <laughs> Such panoramic shots. I'm more afraid of his camera angles, bro. Well, now level 102. Well, I think I know who to use. Then Krillin, should I have to use him? Then God forbid I should use Gohan at any point. Alright, let's do this. Because this is the last fight, and no whistling will be involved in the decimation of the Super Namek. <coughs> Excuse me. Ready? Man, he's huge. Wait. Ooh, that's a good move. That is actually a good move, and that's going to... 
and it's also good as in it's going to help me find the Dragon Ball. Nope. <laughs> nope. Come on. Where's that Dragon Ball? Give me one more Dragon Ball to do stuff. Ow, ow, ow. Dick. Ooh, that was entirely luck based. That wasn't because I saw it. That time I got him. Luckily I have the defense to go a while. I still have the alpha and on, don't I? If that's the case, I should totally be in Super Saiyan form for this. Hell yeah! And I'm pretty sure instant transmission command man does not work on this guy. By the way, what's it called in this game? Hang on, is it called Warp Command Man? I know they change the name frequently. Instant command man. Okay. So I'll be sure of that. Yeah. These houses don't have any Dragon Balls. I could use Dragon Balls. Nope. I like, this, I like this image right now. I'm Super Saiyan, but I'm running with my tail with my tail between my legs against Lord Slug. Who got his ass destroyed by a fake Super Saiyan. Ooh, that was bad. Ah, shit. Hmm. Nothing of interest here whatsoever. Nope. Oh fuck. Did that get blow up the earth? No, it didn't. No. That's mildly surprising. Ah oh, man, there's no Dragon Balls here. This is ridiculous. Have I destroyed all the houses? I know this is boring, guys, but bear with me. I'll probably get a lot of this out until I get it. Ow. Come on, dude. Uh, you know what? While I'm doing this, I should probably get Saiyan and so on. There we go. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Oh, shit. Oh, I can't block that. Cool. Well, not really so much block it, it's more like deflected and put him into a huge stun state. Wow, there's nothing here. This place is desolate. How? That was a low sweep? How the hell is I supposed to guess that was a low sweep? Ow. Maybe my pose will s deter him from using that move. Alright, I've dicked around long enough. What the hell? I can't predict these moves. Why the hell did I just do that? Alright, it's time to rock and roll. Oh man, so satisfying to actually hit this guy. That was just a random observation, but I don't think we've ever seen Super Saiyan 3 Goku shirtless. Or at least revealing this much of his torso. Ooh. And for some reason, Super Saiyan 3 Goku does not have access to a rolling hammer, which is dumb because that's what one of the things that made him really good in the next game. Well, I can definitely hit him with an ultra move. Ah. Dude, seriously, stop doing that. Wow, why am I so low on health on energy already? There we go. I like how quick I'm able to play him up his energy or his health when I'm actually trying. There we go. Bam. Yeah, Halo needs to be put on Goku. That should do it. Yay! Super explosive ways to solve everything. Well, let's go on leveled up. That's for everyone else. Yeah, could have done better, I think.
Oh man, Piccolo is just not having a good day, is he? Until Piccolo calls out a bizarre request. Someone whistle. You have to whistle. Wow, they got that lining on him. Jeez. Apparently, human whistling is on a frequency that causes intense pain to Namekian ears. How about that shit? As Gohan's whistling paralyzed Slot. Piccolo entrusted Goku with all of his energy. Oh no. Oh, that's so lazy. G Goku, take my power. Yeah, I did. Right. And with additional energy borrowed from the sun, Goku unleashed a spirit bomb powerful enough to crush Slug. Huzzah! Earth was once again saved. Why is it that this disaster. map is never playable in the games? Or at least in the beat the Tenkaichi games. It is strange. But I'll deal with it. Yeah. I don't fucking know.